Michigan's growing deer population is causing problems for the state's wildlife and drivers on our roads. Good evening. I'm Ann Emmerich. And I'm David Andrews. News 10 Zachariah Wheaton is in Meridian Township tonight for day one of their deer management program. Zachariah. Yeah, that's right, David and Ann. It is getting to that point of the year where our morning and evening commutes, they're going to start to get even more challenging thanks to all the deer. And, well, Meridian Township, once again, they're hoping to do something about it, kicking off their annual deer management program today. Now, that is beginning today. Uh, 67 trained archers in Meridian Township. They are hunting on private and public properties throughout the area. Along with more car accidents, one of the organizers of the program says the larger population of deer is also hurting plant life and bringing unwanted pests and diseases. Now, in their 13th year, organizers say the program is working. And in that span, they've seen a 36% decrease in accidents. We're just looking to make our deer herd healthier, to improve our ecological areas. Um, to see if we can reduce ticks by reducing some of these deer in the township. Um, there's a lot of things that can happen that we're, we're hopeful for. And they do make sure that all that venison meat doesn't go to waste as uh, most of the meat actually is donated to around 15 local pantries every year. And as a matter of fact, last year they were able to donate over 6,000 pounds of venison as they're hoping for a similar result this time around. Reporting live in Meridian Township, I'm Zachariah Wheaton, News 10. All right, Zachariah, thank you. The program starts today, it runs through January 1st. Well, there's a definite